Hey Eggheads, how are you? Kenan here with New Egg Now, where we bring you the best products for the best prices. This segment is an introduction for the Huion H610 Pro version 2 drawing tablet. Let's get right to the unboxing. Inside the box you have your Huion H610 Pro version 2. You've got a user manual, USB cable, you have the wireless battery-free pen, as well as a pen holder that has eight spare nibs inside. That is pretty great. All right, great, so the tablet itself, one moment, the tablet itself weighs about just one pound, all right, and it is 13.9 inches by 9.6 inches and just one centimeter thick, one centimeter thick. Your workspace is 10 inches by 6.25 inches. In my opinion, it's essentially the perfect size for a drawing tablet. You don't want something so large that you tire your wrist with long strokes, right? And you obviously can't have something too tiny. These dimensions are gonna make it really easy to fit into any small suitcase or backpack so you're no longer limited to creating indoors. Take it out to the coffee shop, take it out to the park, or back and forth from the office. The build quality is quite sturdy, all right? And you've also got four rubber feet, one, two, three, four, four rubber feet on the back, all right, to give it extra durability, extra stability. Uh, I didn't use it myself for longer than a day, so I can't personally attest to the long-term feeling, but I've read a lot of reviews all raving about how great it feels over time, how durable the build is, which is fantastic in this price range. Let's talk about how the tablet functions, all right? Firstly, it's suitable for both left and right hand users. You can use the rotate settings from the driver work area tab and choose flip 180 degrees and simply flip your Huey on to correct the position for you, all right? No one is left out, haha. -ha. You get 8,192 levels of pen pressure sensitivity every detail delicately recorded, coupled with 5,080 LPI in resolution and 233 PPS in reading rates. You'll experience ultimate levels of precision and control and no lines will be lost to lag. On the side here, you've got eight customizable express keys. The default functions are undo, eraser, pencil, zoom in, zoom out, increase pencil size, decrease pencil size, and scroll. And along the top, you see these numbers here? Along the top, you've also got 16 customizable soft keys. All of this customization makes it 100% possible for anyone to streamline the workflow process. Worry less about buttons and functions and just have fun creating. Next, I need to talk about the pen. This truly wireless battery-free pen is a game changer. Never worry about your pen dying while you're drawing. Never deal with a super annoying cord in the way the whole time. It's just you and your work. It sits well in the stand. It rests well in the hand. It's light, but has substantial grip to it. Wonderful balance. You get two customizable buttons on the pen as well, which is great. You'll probably use one for a scroll wheel function. The Huion H610 Pro version 2 is compatible on Windows and Mac OS, plus operation on Android is now supported. That's right. Devices running Android 6.0 and above, including phones and tablets, are now supported, which will make it more possible for your work to hit the mainstream and allow you to design in a surprising plethora of ways. And because the work area on a PC or laptop is different from a phone or tablet, the work area on the H610 Pro version 2 will also be different depending on what you're connected to. For a PC or laptop, the work area will just be this whole thing, 10 inches by 6.25 inches. And for Android phone or tablet connection, the work area will be slightly smaller, 6.25 inches by 3.9 inches. However, if you wanna use it for an Android phone or tablet, you'll need to purchase an OTG connector, okay? The OTG connector is sold separately. My dear eggheads, that's pretty much it. I'd say you'd be very hard pressed to find a comparable drawing tablet in this price range. You get 8,192 levels of sensitivity, reading rates that will never lag, tons and tons of customizable buttons, a truly wireless pen, cord-free, battery-free, eight extra nibs inside here, 
works on a PC or laptop. It's going to work with a phone or a tablet. With all of this functionality, I just have one question. Is there any excuse left for not creating your masterpiece right now? I don't think so. Bring your masterpiece to life with the Huion H610 Pro version 2. For current pricing, please check the description or click that link below. I'm Kenan with Newegg Now, and now you know. What's up, eggheads? Kenan here with Newegg Now, bringing you the hottest products for the lowest prices. In this segment, we are looking at the Ku K2 14.1 inch notebook. It's an awesome option for a low cost notebook that you should definitely consider. Now I would normally do an unboxing moment, but this is actually everything you get in the box. You get a power cord, a warranty card, instruction pamphlet, some stickers, a carrying bag, and of course the laptop itself. All right, let's open it up here. Ta-da! You've got a 14.1 inch 1920 by 1080 FHD IPS screen housed in an all metal body. As you can see, they've really maximized screen space here. Look, all this, the side bezels right, are extremely thin. That's really good. There's a webcam up top that has a built-in privacy slider. Check this out. Right, built-in privacy slider for the webcam. The keyboard is backlit, so you can work even in the darkest of environments. And they have a pretty, pretty neat dual-purpose touchpad here. All right, it can be used either as a mouse or as a number pad, perhaps if you're using a separate mouse. I should also mention that the power key here is equipped with fingerprint unlocking to give you peace of mind and ultimate privacy. Let's talk about what's going on under the hood. The KU K2 is equipped with an Intel Celeron J4115 processor, Intel UHD Graphics 600, that's 1.8 gigahertz, four cores, and four threads, ensuring high performance and fast response speed. You get eight gigabytes of DDR4 RAM and a 512 gigabyte SATA 3 SSD. Honestly, for a budget laptop, that's pretty rad. You'll be able to have a lot of programs running simultaneously on this. You'll get fast reading and writing of data with that SSD. You'll boot quickly, run software smoothly. It should be really stable. And if you're on the go, you'll get 12 hours of standby time and five hours of working time with the 38 watt hour lithium polymer battery. So basically enough battery power to last any domestic flights and certainly most meetings. So that's basically it everyone. I've noticed that the maximum brightness of the screen isn't super bright and the speakers aren't super loud, but they're okay. And that's totally fine for a budget laptop. I believe Ku has made sacrifices in all the right places here. They don't waste your money on packing the box in an overly flashy way. You don't get super loud speakers or an overly bright screen, but the video looks good. It sounds fine. It's got eight gigabytes of RAM and a large solid state drive to run all of your programs smoothly. The keyboard is thoughtful as the keys span the whole width of the machine, allowing each key to be slightly bigger than the average for laptops. You've got that dual function mouse pad slash number pad. You've got USB, HDMI, micro SD, and audio ports. You've got that webcam with a privacy slider and a fingerprint power button. I think you're good to go. I can totally see this being perfect for classrooms. You can just fill it up with 20 or 30 of these for a bunch of students. It's perfect for any company who wants to give out company laptops to a bunch of employees, or it's perfect for anyone on a budget who still wants a machine powerful enough to do some professional work. The KU cool K2 14.1 inch notebook, ladies and gentlemen. For current pricing, please check the description or click that link below. I'm Kenan with Newegg Now, and now you know. What's up, eggheads? How are you? I'm Kenan with Newegg Now, bringing you the best products for the best prices. In this segment, we're taking a look at the Tongmai W5 wireless earbuds. A pair of earbuds definitely worth your consideration. Without further ado, let's open the box. Tongmai has packaged this very well. This centerpiece looks like a wax seal, makes it look like we're invited to some kind of important event. And as you can see here, let me take this out. Okay, the charging slash carrying case 
is really fashionable. It feels smooth. It's space gray with their logo on top on a black surface. The USB charging port can be found on the bottom as well as a power button on the back. It's constructed out of an ultra light alloy as are the earbuds themselves. Okay, and that makes, uh, that really ensures durability and an almost weightlessness for ease of use while traveling around. As you've seen, the true wireless earbuds are already awaiting you inside, prepared with medium sized earbud covers. Those are gonna be medium sized by default. A small and large pair are found in the accessory box below, along with a USB charging cable. All right, so let's get technical. The Tangmai W5s use creatively balanced armature drivers, delivering music with a wide soundstage, exceptional accuracy and clarity. You also get the latest Qualcomm chipsets, enabled with aptX codec, promising to bring you high-res audio for lossless music. I ran a sound check myself on audiocheck.net, and I found that I could still hear subwoofer kick down at 20 hertz and high range signals up at 14 kilohertz. I heard pristine left and right channel separation and in a half full airport lounge, I ran a dynamic check and was able to hear voiceover at 46 decibels below full scale. Each earbud is equipped with two microphones for a total of four mics between the two and CVC 8.0 noise reduction technology for superior vocal enhancement and background noise suppression. So basically, when you're on a call, environmental noises are reduced and your voice is retained. So even in noisy locations, you come through richly and confidently. And while testing all this out, I made sure to do the shake test, as you can see here, just to verify that they really fit snug in the ear and they totally do. These will not be falling out on you. Another extremely important detail to look out for when you're shopping around for truly wireless earbuds is the battery life. And the Tangmai W5s don't disappoint at all. A single charge gives you eight hours of listening time, up to 10 if you're only at half volume, and the charging case can extend playing time up to 48 hours. So let's do the math. You charge the case and then you go on a trip. You love listening to music so much that you listen eight hours a day. You could do that seven days without having to think about recharging. And if you're more normal and only listen one or two hours a day, perhaps a daily podcast or some tunes while working out, you could get nearly a month of playing time without having to recharge the case. The buds are gonna to connect to your phone super easily, very plug and play, although there's no plugging in required here, so I guess it's just play. The W5s will automatically connect to the last paired device, so you get one-step pairing and simple touch control as the high sensitive touch sensors right here on the side let you answer calls, adjust the track, or pause the music with the simple touch of a button. And that's all, folks. The Tangmai W5s deliver quite an impressive array of perks. You get that fresh looking metallic alloy case and earbuds, passing all the important sound tests, come with comfortable earbud covers for all sizes. You get four mics and noise canceling for calls, up to eight hours of listening time and 48 hours of charge uh, on a single charge of the case for a total of 56 hours of listening time without having to recharge. And they connect right when you take them out of the case. All right, so for current pricing, please check the description or click that link below. I'm Kenan with Newegg Now, and now you know. What's up, Eggheads? I'm Kenan, one of your product hosts with Newegg Now, where we introduce you to the latest tech for the greatest prices. In this segment, we are taking a look at the Wavelink USB 3.0 Universal Docking Station. Let's open the box and have a look. Okay, in the box, you've got a Wavelink Universal Docking Station, a 12 volt, four amp power adapter, one DVI to VGA adapter, a three foot USB cable, and lastly, an instruction manual and a warranty card. Awesome. The docking station itself packs a strong punch in a tiny package here. All right, check it out. We've got a handsome, polished design, not wasting any space. And just have a look at these ports. 
You've got HDMI and DVI slash VGA. That's simultaneous dual display, by the way. I'll get to that later. There's gigabit ethernet port, two USB quick charging ports in red that get up to 2.4 amps. Those can charge two phones or iPads at the same time. You got two USB-A 3.0 ports that transfer up to five gigabits per second and use only 900 milliamps of power. And two USB 2.0 ports for any keyboard or mouse. You've got audio in and out and of course your power supply. The docking station supports hot swapping and provides USB over current protection. We like our stuff plug and play and this is like a plug and play playground. All right, I want to talk more about the dual display. I mentioned you get the HDMI and the DVI slash VGA dual display, right? With this docking station, you can connect up to two additional monitors, HDTVs, or projectors to your computer for a total of three screens. This little black box is the only thing standing between you and having a setup like in the Matrix. You can get dual display in 2K resolution, so whether you're a video editor and want one screen for your media bin and one for your timeline, or if you're a gamer who keeps one screen up for tutorial videos and one on the other side for your game, if you just want to be a crazy multitasker, this gives you great home and office flexibility. It's compatible with a lot of systems as well. Windows XP, Vista, 7, 8, 10, Windows Server 2003, 2008, and 2008 R2. Compatible with Mac OS X with Intel processors as well. One note, 64-bit editions of XP are not supported, but just upgrade to Windows 7, 8, or 10 and enjoy this docking station. Get up to three screens by adding two additional monitors at 2K resolution, charge phones or iPads simultaneously, get gigabit ethernet, listen to music, record audio, do it all with the Wavelink USB 3.0 universal docking station. All right, for current prices, please check the description or click that link below. I'm Kenan, this has been Newegg Now, and now you know.